As marine sentinels, the health of penguins tells us a lot about the health of their environment. Like humans, a key measurement of health is weight. But people are pretty easy to weigh. Weighing a penguin is not easy. First, you have to catch it. It is. Okay, it's in my hand. Then you have to suspend it from a spring balance. And then we make the penguin fly. And then the hard part is you have to wait for a key moment when the penguin stops wiggling. All right, now you settle down. Hi. Then you've got to wait. 3.9. Neither the human nor the penguin really enjoys this process. Solution, get a penguin to weigh itself with no help from us. But this isn't easy. Some penguins walk slow, some run really fast. And this can change their weight. In the wild, you have to get them to walk across the scale and many of them are pretty hesitant to walk across something that they don't know. Mechanical engineering students Nathan and Andre made a scale longer and wrote complicated detailed code to discard incorrect weights so that we could weigh one penguin at a time. Using penguins at the Woodland Park Zoo, we tested the scale and it got pretty comical. <laughs> you have to coax the penguin, there are a lot of program modifications, and eventually, if you're lucky, a penguin walks across and gets an accurate weight. Next, we have to take the scale to the field to weigh penguins walking to and from their nests, and then add an identification component so we can know who the individual is, when it crosses the scale, and which direction it's going, to the sea or to its nest. We can learn whether the opening and closing of a fisheries affects their foraging success. Technology can unlock key secrets like how fisheries impact penguins. Having penguins weigh themselves helps monitor and protect these marine sentinels in the wild. Mm. Mm.